Kara Eaker competes in the floor exercise during the Women's U.S. Olympic Gymnastics Trials on Friday, June 25, 2021, in St. Louis. Apit's official, Leanne Wang and Kara Eaker are headed to Tokyo. They narrowly missed spots on the U.S. Olympic Gymnastics team, but both Kansas City area gymnasts earned spots as alternates at the U.S. Gymnastics Trials in St. Louis on Sunday. With Simone Biles and Sunisa Lee securing the top two spots at Trials and Jordan Chiles an assumed third all-arounder, the fourth spot was going to be decided by tenths of a point. Wang was among the top contenders for the spot, along with Grace McCallum and Michaela Skinner, who were both ultimately named to the team, McCallum as all-around and Skinner as the second individual, joining Jade Carey. Wang, a recent Blue Valley high grad and incoming Florida Gator, appeared to have a legitimate chance, given that the team was in need of another strong floor routine and she was tied for second in floor with Chili's, who was also named to the all-around team. Women's high-performance team coordinator Tom Forster said he was committed to the integrity of the selection process and wanted to rely on performances as they were, not potential. One of my big responsibilities that I put on myself is retaining the integrity of competition and sportsmanship and objectivity, Forster said, and gymnastics is a subjective sport. We all know that. And so, as much as possible, we want the athletes to prove themselves on the competition floor in the field of play. We just feel it's the better thing to do is to let the athletes select themselves on the field of play as much as possible. Just 18 days separate the trials and the start of team training in Tokyo, and because of that, Forster said the trials held more weight than the US championships, and all the athletes and coaches were aware of that. McCallum was awarded the fourth all-around spot as the fourth-place finisher Sunday. If Wang had not fallen in her beam routine Friday and scored similarly to Sunday's 14.000 beam score, she would have finished in fourth ahead of McCallum. But the selection couldn't be based around what-if scenarios. Both KC area gymnasts will be in Tokyo as replacement athletes, ready to step in should injuries or positive COVID-19 cases occur among anyone else on the Team USA roster. I'm so honored to be go with these girls. They're so amazing," said Eaker, the recent Grain Valley high grad who will head to the University of Utah later this summer. Just being so incredibly proud of myself and also Leanne for being able to come with me, and knowing how much we how much work we put into this and knowing that it's all worth it. I work with, Leanne, every day, and I know how much that she puts in and that we do together, and just being able to experience this together, it means so much to me knowing that we both get to achieve our dreams. Eaker finished 7th overall with 111.